I'm back. Well, I just have to do this cassette. Oh, by the way. Yeah, tama po yung nasa aking thumbnail. It's all about coronavirus. So, how we could prevent it and what we can do as an ordinary person. So, tama, don't panic. You know, number one, don't panic. There's so many ways to prevent it. So, I'm gonna read to you what I have here. It's from the Service Canada. So, Canada, www.canada.ca. So, don't panic. And I'm back. Okay. So now it's getting like rampant uh, from day to day. Let me let me say my own sentiments regarding coronavirus. So I would say as uh, I mean ordinary individual katulad mo or katulad nyo, um panic yun ang papatay sa atin. or yun ang magdadala sa atin sa coronavirus um, number one nating tatandaan na ang coronavirus ay katulad din ng mga na mga flu, SARS, remember SARS? S-A-R-S hindi Sarah Hieronimo but SARS wale 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 yeah but we all we did overcome that so Tawag nito, may mga bagay tayo na pwedeng gawin na para ma-prevent ang coronavirus or para ma-prevent na magkaroon ng ganun. So, now I'm holding my phone at meron akong mga babasahin na from the service from the government of Canada itself. Shut up. Shut your mouth. Nandito yung mga updates symptoms, treatment, prevention and risk, and being prepared. So, I guess, medyo ano to, makakatulong at somehow sa atin. Uh, dito sa Canada, and especially, I think, applicable din to sa inyo kasi, ang pangalan nito. Yeah, it's everywhere now. I mean, Kahit saan ako makatumingin, ang daming, uh, ang daming halos lahat na ata may cases ng coronavirus. So, here in Canada, as of March 9, 2020, uh, 72 cases of corona COVID-19 COVID have been confirmed in Canada. So, I'll flash it on the screen yung confirmed cases uh, from different uh, provinces. And looks like meron na, sa Albert, meron na sa Alberta. And hopefully, hindi na dumating dito sa Saskatchewan. Kasi, yun nga. It's not good. And for global countries, almost everywhere meron na. Including, of course, yung mahal nating bansang Pilipinas. So, a little bit of history. December 31st, 2019. The World had World Health organization was alerted to several cases of pneumonia in Wuhan, China. The virus did not match any other known virus. On January 7, 2020, China confirmed COVID-19. Yun yung tawag sa coronavirus. Okay, moving forward. Dito sa... Okay, so those sa may mga plano mag-travel in the future, katulad ko, um, before you leave, Check the following destinations that did have travel health notices for COVID-19 such as Hong Kong, China, Iran, Japan, Northern Italy, 
Singapore and South Korea. So those are the countries na e-check nyo yung mga travel health uh, notices kasi may mga notices for sure kung plano nyo yung pumunta sa mga bansang nabanggit. So better check it first para sigurado lang. So yeah, uh, for all travelers, check your destination first and check all health risk um, notices para sigurado lang tayo. So that's for traveling. Avoid all cruise ship travel. So the Public Health Agency of Canada is recommending that Canadians, all Canadians, avoid all cruise ship travel due to the ongoing coronavirus 19 outbreak. Napakasimple lang, nung mga pwede natin gawin para ma-prevent ang coronavirus, hindi lang dito sa Canada, pero of course, kahit sa amang parte ng mundo, very informative tong um, pinost ng Canada.ca para sa lahat. It is a serious uh, matter, really. So, be prepared. So, number one, here sa Canada, it's still low, so, but it's better to be prevent, ba Sabi nga nila, prevention is, um, uh, ano yun? Shut up! Shut your mouth! Prevention is better than cure. There. So, here's the important note. Everyone has a role to play. So, hindi pwedeng gobyerno lang lahat. So, ikaw, sarili mo, meron kang pwedeng magawa. I mean, may dapat kang gawin. So, for individuals, according to Canada.ca, Okay, during the cold and flu season, stay home if you're sick. Tandaan, stay home if you're sick. And if you feel like you're having a having a bad day, uh, sa tingin mo pwedeng mag to cold or flu, stay at home. And huwag ka nang lalabas kung sa tingin mo makakahawa ka. I mean, huwag ka nang lumabas. Did you get that? So, practice frequent hand hygiene and coughing and sneezing etiquette. Clean and disinfect frequently touch objects and surfaces such as toys and doorknobs. So, panatalihin natin malinis ang kamay. That's most important. Kasi, ang virus eh, usually, amin natin sa kamay. Kapag madumi ang kamay mo, at, say, umawa ka sa isang bagay na hindi ka sigurado kung malinis o hindi. Kapag madumi yan at napunta sa kamay mo, usual and tendency, ihawak sa muka. Aminin natin, ginagawa natin lahat dyan. Kaya, if you could practice hand hygiene all the time, say, humawa ka sa isang bagay o pumunta ka sa isang lugar, nag-wash yung coin, all that, you always make sure na maghugas. Wala namang masamang maghugas. I mean, that's the best way to do. Actually, kung, I don't know, maalala nyo pa, uh, 20 seconds. Hi, guys! Hi! Did you know we need to be washing our hands for 20 seconds? What? Oh, I know! So I've written this little tune to help us know just how long 20 seconds is. Would you like to sing it with me, girls? Yeah. yeah. Let's do it. A one, two, three, four. Wash them, wash them, wash your hands. Wash them for 20 seconds. Wash them, wash them, wash your hands. Get them nice and clean. Kapag isasara mo na yung knob o yung tap, use a paper towel or cloth. Kasi nga, ang tendency, pag ginamit mo yung raw hands, raw hand mo doon, ay di madumi pa rin. I mean, madudumihan pa rin. So, ito naman yung sinabi dito, when cleaning and running water isn't available. So, say yung mga nagtatabo, like sa Pilipinas, maraming nagtatabo, aminin natin yan, or anywhere, following each individual use. So, no sharing. That did you get that? That's it. And sanitizer. Napaka-importante ng sanitizer this day. So, um, if we could have, o oh, kung meron kang, like, small bottle lang na lagay mo sa bag or somewhere accessible, that's a good one. Ito, interesting. Stock up and all essentials but avoid panic buying. So ngayon, usong-uso ang nagpa-panic buying. Dito, nauubos na lahat ng to toilet papers and lahat ng cleaning wipes. 
Nagkakaubusan. <coughs> so, ibig sabihin, no to panic buying. Dan lang yun. Hindi mo kailangan mag-panic buying. I mean, it's, it is essential to stock up, but hindi yung tipong bibilin mo na yung buong grocery store or yung buong shopping mall para lang magkaroon ng, ng mga what you call it? Non-perishable food items. So, ito, if you wanna stock up some food items, um, dried pasta and sauce, prepared canned soups, canned veggies and beans, and also, to have extra um, pet food, kung meron ko mga hayop, kasi they also matter, I mean, natin yan. Toilet paper, but not panic buy. I mean, no hoarding. Feminine hygiene products, diapers, if you have babies, there. Human coronaviruses cause infections of the nose, throat, and lungs. So, nose, throat, and lungs. They are the most commonly spread from an infected person through, and then, through respiratory droplets generated when, when you cough or sneeze. So, kapag ikaw naubuhan or na naachinghan ng tao may virus, you might get it. Did you get that? Close, prolonged personal contact such as touching and shaking hands. So, if we could avoid it. But yeah, like I said, di ba sabi ko nung una, kung meron ka lang mini sanitizer in your pocket or, or in your bag, that's it. Kasi, always bring it. Yan ang ating uh, must-have nowadays. Sanitizer or uh, hand wipes there. So, katulad ng sinabi ko kanina, hands ang pinaka-powerful na parte ng katawan natin ngayon. Kasi you'll never know. Kapag madami ang kamay mo, now, kung nasa mukha mo and all that, there's a chance, really, na makuha mo siya. Kasi nga sa madaming kamay. So, kung mapapanatilihin natin ng malinis na kamay every time, malinis naman yung kamay ko, nagugas ako at nagsanitize naman big, bago mag-vlog. Are you sure? Eh. So, kung mapaprevent natin yung pag I mean uh, kung makakapaghugas tayo ng kamay I mean continuously or ang tawag sa ganun shut up shut your mouth shut your mouth like routinely there that's the term makapaghugas tayo ng kamay routinely I think should be good hell yeah so iwasan muna ang matataong lugar kung kinakailangan kasi baka magkaroon ka kasi sa matataong lugar syempre bumatao ang tendency close contact ka inyan kasi sa, sa dami ng tao so kung may iwasan naman na wag na munang pumunta sa mga matataong lugar wag na muna kung di naman kailangan diba kaya tsaka sinabi rin dito na like if you if you plan to shop like kunin nyo yung mga non-rush hours like yung non-peak times ganon Say, may mga ganun naman, di ba, yung mga shopping malls? Like, uh, may mga hours na hindi masyadong busy. So, yeah, pick those times just to be sure, right? Kung kinakailangan lang naman lumabas at mag-shop. But other than that, kung wala namang gagawin, Stay at home. Did you get that? Actually, there's a lot more to read. So, kung pupuntahan nyo lang yung www.canada.ca Ano lahat ang information that you need to know On how to prevent uh, How to be prepared uh, Yung details, history And uh, kung saan nag-umpisa yung um, coronavirus and all that So, yeah, if you wanna go to www.canada.ca Ano lahat ng information na makakatulong sa atin to combat coronavirus. And like I said uh, in my thumbnail, don't panic. <coughs> Tandaan, don't panic. It's organic. Walang connection, but yeah. Sure. Wale, 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 wale. Sana may natutunan kayo kahit medyo um, magulo yung aking explanation, but I guess nasabi ko naman yung mga basic mga basic na pwede natin gawin as individual uh, person. So, www.canada.ca and I know meron din yan sa mga iba-ibang bansa yung uh, their own uh, precautionary measures. So, alamin nyo lang yan sa inyong mga lugar. So, 
Like I said, don't panic kasi hindi makakatulong at all. Understand? Sana naintindihan mo yun. Hell yeah! And that's it for today's vlog. Sana may natutunan kayo kahit kakatiting. And don't worry, I'll leave the link in the description box uh, about the coronavirus sa www.canada.ca So, thanks for watching and if you think this vlog is informative and helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe that button and see you on my next vlog. Bye-bye!